Walk me through how Sid is going to help us free Matt. Um, are you really sure about this? I mean, I know he can help, but it's Matt Miller. We need all the help we can get. How do we get him? Well, I give Sid the proper cipher to connect to Matt's personal simulation, and he opens the gateway. This should be a fucking adventure. I was shocked when the boss picked you to be the vice president, but you ended up working out. That's only vaguely insulting. Look, you sound just like Julius Little. Putting a guy who betrayed you in the number two slot seems like a great way to get killed. I'm nothing like Julius. Kinsey, we're ready. I'm sending Sid the jailbreak. Any last advice? When you're inside Matt's virtual oubliette, there's a decent chance that I'll be focusing on interfacing with the intrusion countermeasures, so pay attention to the console commands. Any last advice I'll understand? Don't get killed. Gotcha. Self-proclaimed hacker god ran all the cyber terrorism for the Syndicate back in Steelport. No, he's Asha's right-hand man in MI6. I just hope we can trust him like she does. You can give me a gun any time, Kinsey. Well, you don't have superpowers either. Jesus Christ, Kinsey. Why the fuck are there words in my face? It's a command prompt. Just give me a second. This brings back memories. Damn it! The camera's screwed up. I just have to deal with it. Fucking 80s. Just throwing this out there, but uh, I don't want to be staring at the ground for the rest of my life. I'm trying, but I'm not used to the code they're using. Give me a second. Could it be as simple as... 3D? Don't you dare hit enter, Kinsey! Oops. Sorry. Finger slipped. Oh, thank God. There should be three data towers controlling the security to Matt's prison. Finally, I get to just blow shit up. Well, I wouldn't want you to go outside your comfort zone. I must say... I am amused at this attempt to save a man who tried to kill you once. <laughs> Three times, Zinyak. Try to keep up. All the same, what is it you hope to accomplish? Mr. Miller is beyond your help. We'll see about that. <sighs> Very well. Your futile attempts do entertain me, after all. That has to be embarrassing. That's a lot of firepower. Destroying the tower should destroy the tanks with it. This Kensington is rather astute for a human. Yeah, well, big towers controlling security on a linear path. Not very creative for your superior intelligence. Ugh. Touche. to go. Now you're still kind of on my virtual shit list, Kinsey. For what? Last time we were in cyberspace, you turned me into a sex doll. God, are you still mad about that? I said I was sorry. You gave me access to the webcam you set up in Viola's room. It's not an apology, that's creepy.
lower, then we grab Matt. Oh, I don't think it should be that easy for you. He's made the tower invulnerable. Hang on, I'll find a workaround. Always feels good to kick ass. Me up, Kinsey. Wait, let me try something. And you do. Yet again, I am impressed by Miss Kensington. Though this attempt is as futile as the life of most humans. Oh look, an alien with a superiority complex. Surprising. Though this sentiment comes from more than just the Zin, my dear. Tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day. To the last syllable of recorded time. And all our yesterdays have lighted fools the way to dusty death. Brief candle, life's but a walking shadow, a poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage, and then is heard no more. It is a tale told by an idiot, full of sound and fury, signifying nothing. Thanks for sharing your high school poetry. It's a quote from Macbeth. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Prison. How am I gonna start a prison break without a gun? Chances are it's not a standard behind bars sort of prison. You'll just have to wing it. Wing it? Great. What can go wrong? Oh, and since I can't see what's going on in there, Dad will be able to help you either. Fuck me running. a choice. Walk through the blue door and continue to face yet more failures at saving those closest to you. Your race will live on borrowed time and will, through your violent arrogance, wind up extinct. Walk through the red door, however, and I will release the humans whom I have collected. I will give them amnesty and even a ship from my fleet to do with as they see fit. However, in choosing this door, you will willingly submit yourself to execution. This is the moment where you can prove to be the savior of humanity, or its absolute destroyer. What am I looking at? This is your life as it led you to this point. All your past violence, crimes, and losses on display to remind you of one simple fact. Regardless of what I have done to your world, you were its greatest threat. The evidence is irrefutable. How many have died because you decided that driving on the sidewalk is faster than the road? Because you used a rocket in place of a bullet? Because you wouldn't submit to my rule? In the end, you only hurt those you are trying to protect. In the end, there is only one. True. The human race would be much safer without you in it. <sighs> Memories. 
It was total bullshit that you could only carry 200 pounds of bison meat. Wait, is that math? Trapped in technology he doesn't understand, in a cyber world he can't control. Matt, stay calm. I'll get you out. Without Miss Kensington. Very doubtful. Behold my empire. Wow. Empty space and a purple star. This is but a glimpse of what I have conquered. Ah, yes. I'm quite proud of this one. Why? What is it? Terror, as personified by your literary culture. A dead pirate with a black parrot? It's a raven. Why does the pirate have a raven? <sighs> Is this the island that pirate came from? Must you continue to display your plebeian intelligence? Yes. I tire of this. Deal with her on your own. Ta-ta. I can deal with anything you throw at me, buddy. Jesus Christ, Zenyak, are you 13? All right, pick up the phone and dial yourself out, Matt. like the idea of us sitting around. Shouldn't we be picking up Matt? The kid could be in trouble. Keith, you gotta relax. The guy's an MI6 agent, for God's sake. He can take care of himself. You needed help getting out, and you're the commander-in-chief. That's a really good point. Why didn't we think of this earlier? Oh, I did. I'm just not a big fan of Matt. Kinsey, come on! Can't I get some payback? Got a little lost, big deal. Or he got a little dead, who knows? Oh, he's fine. He's probably having the time of his life exploring Zinyak's ship. 